Okay, so we are about to embark on a journey, a journey to meet your inner being, your higher self, your intuition, your spirit guides. It doesn't matter what you call it, you know it's higher wisdom. And that's where we're heading. So I want you to make sure that you've got a pen and paper because you're going to be taking notes or whatever you're going to use to write with. But you need to make it easy because the writing just needs to flow. And I want you to ask a question. Write down the question. And if this is your first time, don't make it a tough question. Make it relatively open and easy question. Remember, the idea here is we want to start to build rapport with our inner being because we haven't spoken, we haven't used our intuition really consciously in a long time. So we need to rebuild trust, we need to rebuild rapport. And so with that said, set an intention. And the intention is to make a strong connection with your intuition and to get some really valuable answers to your question. And with your intention now set, I want you to close your eyes. Take a few deep breaths, sit up straight. Just relax your body, shrug your shoulders, relax your body, take a few deep breaths. Breathing in. And breathe out. And breathe in. And breathe out. Breathe in. And breathe out with a big sigh. Oh. One more time. Breathe. Deep breath in. And a big sigh, let it all out. Oh. And now just allow your breathing just to start to regulate. Just back to normal breathing. And in your mind, I want you to imagine that you're walking through a forest. It's a beautiful forest, tall trees, sunlight, streaming through the dappled leaves. You can smell the vegetation, the undergrowth. Just notice all the colors, the different greens and browns and grays and golds. Just notice the colors. Notice the smells. And just, you're walking down the path and you're just looking and what are you hearing? You can hear the birds. so quiet, nobody is there, just you. You're walking and just really thrilling to be in nature, in this beautiful forest. And then you notice that there's a track, there's a pathway just off the main track and you decide you're gonna walk down that path and see where it goes. And it's a much narrower pathway, but still, trees and as you walk down this pathway you can reach out and you can touch branches and you can touch trees right there you don't have to bend down it's comfortable to walk but they're right there you can touch them you can smell them and you can smell the denseness the you can smell nature and you can taste the freshness of the air and as you're walking through this path, you notice that you come to a fork in the road, in the pathway. And one of the forks, forks left. And one of the forks, fork to the right. And you choose to take the fork to the right. And you see and you notice that this path meanders down. 
and all of a sudden you're in a clearing. And way ahead of you, you can see there's a stream, right? You'll have to walk down to it, but there's a stream there. And you, you walk down to the stream and it's just beautiful. You look back, you can see the forest behind you and it's a nice gamble down to the stream. And you notice that there's, there's some beautiful rocks and the stream would be easy to cross. And the stream is just glinting in the, in the light of the sun. Speckled water just running over the rocks. You step over the rocks, you get to the other side, and you walk up a very slight incline. You keep walking and you notice as you're walking, you turn around, you can see the, the stream and you can see the forest behind you. You can just see a, a huge natural vista hills, rolling hills, green hills, and you keep walking up the hill until all of a sudden you come to a plateau. And from this vantage point you can see, it feels like you're on the top of the world, you can see forever, you see the ocean, you see the valley below you, and you're just stunned by the absolute magnificent beauty of everything that you can see around you. And you notice that there's a bench to your right. And on the bench, there's someone sitting on that bench. And that someone is your higher self. That someone is your guide that someone is your intuition. I want you to walk over to the bench. And as you start walking closer and you get closer and closer, notice how familiar it feels. It just feels so congenial, so loving, so warm, so caring. Just notice that feeling of warmth and caring that's emanating from the bench and your higher self on the bench. And you introduce yourself, they say hello, they introduce themselves. And it feels like you're just reuniting with a best, best, best friend. There's so much caring, so much love, and you sit down. And for a moment, you just sit in silence, basking in each other's company. And you just sit and you take in the vista in front of you, feeling the warmth, feeling the love. And then you ask your question. And you ask the question with a view to getting insight, not from your head, not from your heart, but with a view to it coming through you, not from you. You pick up your notepad and you start writing. And you just write without any judgment. You just write whatever comes to your mind. It doesn't matter what comes to your mind. Whatever comes to your mind, start there. If, if you get an image of a, a mandarin, start with that. Just make it up. Just make it up. Just make it up. And just keep writing. And then when you get to the end, ask your guide, is there more? And keep writing. Keep writing. And at the end, don't forget to thank your guide. Thank them three times. Thank you, thank you, thank you.